Thank you for your interest in our products and welcome to our overview of the Napoleon F-Series remote control systems. There are two different Napoleon F-Series remote models, the F-45, which provides on-off control, and the F-60, which provides on-off control as well as thermostatic operation of your heating appliance. Both remote models are composed of two parts, the transmitter and the receiver. The transmitter is the handheld component, while the receiver is the component that connects directly to the appliance and may sometimes be installed in a control compartment or mounted to the wall. Be sure to reference the installation literature provided with these remotes for location restrictions for the receiver. To begin using these remotes, we must first load the batteries and synchronize the handheld to the receiver. You'll need to do this anytime the batteries become depleted or when you wish to change the ID code between the transmitter and receiver. The low battery light will flash on the receiver and the low battery icon will appear on the LCD screen of the transmitter when the batteries require changing. The F45 and F60 receivers require four AA batteries, while the transmitters require two AAA batteries. To remove the batteries in the receiver, press and release the square indent on the battery compartment face and it will eject. To access the battery compartment of the transmitter, slide the lower back of the transmitter off by pressing in and downwards on it with your thumbs. Replace the batteries ensuring the correct positive and negative positions. Once the batteries are replaced, make sure the receiver is set to the remote position. Point the transmitter at the receiver and press the on button on the F45 and the power button on the F60. This allows the receiver to capture the ID code of the transmitter, allowing the two units to communicate properly. The receiver will emit a series of beeps to confirm this. The transmitters of these remote systems also have two optional switches located in the battery compartment. These are the temperature switch and the childproof switch. The temperature switch changes the temperature displayed on the transmitter from Fahrenheit to Celsius. To change the temperature displayed, simply slide the switch to the desired mode and the display will immediately change to indicate Fahrenheit or Celsius. By turning on the childproof switch, all buttons on the transmitter are disabled. A lock icon will display on the transmitter screen to indicate the lockout is in effect. To restore transmitter function, reset the childproof switch to the off position. Please note, if the F60 remote is set to thermostatic operation prior to childproof locking, it will continue to operate thermostatically, but will not allow for temperature adjustment until unlocked. To turn on the F45, press the on button. To turn on the F60, press the power button. If at any time the transmitter is unavailable, you can also manually turn on the heating appliance by sliding the receiver switch to the on position. As mentioned earlier, the F60 model has an additional thermostat button. This turns the appliance on or off based on a set temperature. Both models will display the room temperature, but only the F60 remote will allow the set temperature to be changed. To do this, press the thermostat button, then adjust the set temperature in accordance with your comfort level using the up and down arrow keys on the transmitter. Finally, to turn the fireplace off, simply press the O or OFF button on the F45 transmitter and the power button on the F60 transmitter. This concludes our overview of the Napoleon F45 and F60 remote control systems. Thank you for watching.